Did you find a teddy in the garage? You want to show everybody your teddy? What do you do with your teddy? There's a nice new big yard and farm, isn't it, Lamy? All the beautiful trees. Big trees right here. There's some strange bird there. Don't know yet what it's called. Oh, Teddy. What's that him? Lama found a Teddy in the garage. There was a whole heap of stuffed toys that was left in the garage from the last tenants. He went and, gra he went and grabbed that and showed me it. Oh, is that you telling me to throw it? The last tenant was a bit messy, that's why they got evicted. They never looked after the gardens and dug up the yard, built a bonfire. I'll fix it all up. A couple acres to work out what to do with the gardens. The big centre island garden there I might turn that all into a vegetable patch. And then we've got put some chairs and tables under there and for the summer. And there's another paddock over there and there's a separate one over there. So I'd like to put a goat in there. And then I've got a, a double garage there. And that's where the wood goes. I left a lot of junk behind, but I'll clean it all up. And they had ducks. So I'll get some chooks again. If I just go over the little fence here, a couple acres there. I'd really love to get another horsey, but it's a bit too expensive, not at the moment. Wouldn't mind a couple goats, but or a couple sheep. Got a big shed there. There's the national park, and the forest is just here, like 10 metres from my back fence. You're walking there. And if you go in that direction, for like 80 kilometres, it's just nothing but bush and forest. So, Mark, if you're listening, and Laura, this would be a great place to get some bees going with all the natural trees and flowers. Anyway, it's starting to rain again. Can you believe it's only nine degrees here in Meanda and the rest of Australia is in 30s, 40s and burning up and on my last post you will see that I posted pictures of the mountain in front of my house covered in snow that's the border here and straight there for a couple hundred kilometres in that direction is nothing but wilderness, forest, mountains. Oh, it's all fucking exciting, trust me. I love it. Anyway, that's what I've been waiting for all my life. I have a 79 month lease. So that's a quite a long time and it was approved and accepted. So I can dedicate the time and the money into fixing up the gardens and establishing flower beds and herb beds and that's a big island that used to be there. I'll turn that into a vegetable patch and grow as much as I can. Get some chooks and ducks. Lama just doesn't know what to do with himself, does he? He went exploring in the garage. Did you find a teddy? Show everybody your teddy. Show everybody your teddy. What are you doing with your teddy? 
<laughs> there's like 20 of them, seriously. All different types of teddies, but... You seem to take a liking to that one. Oh, what are we going to do with the teddy? Okay. But we're very upset still. We're into our third week of not knowing where our Lulu is. My cat I've had for a year and a half that I rescued from the the centre the day before she was expected to be put down. But a lot of people have said, cat lovers said that cats just do that, they just take off for a few days or a couple weeks or something, but still hurts. Anyway, we're gonna go.